Travel for July 4th is expected to break records this year here in Florida and around the country. You know, nearly 70 million people are expected to travel 50 miles or more from home and four and a half million of those are expected to be Floridians. So these numbers are based on the nine day period between Saturday, June 29th and Sunday, July 7th. Now, nearly 61 million people will drive to their destination. That's some 5 million more than the 2019 record that was set. AAA says that gas prices were down but have now rebounded in the last few days. So the state average now is 326. That is slightly higher compared to a year ago. Now the worst times to drive will be the Tuesday and Wednesday leading up to the 4th and then on Thursday, July 4th, between 2 in the afternoon and 7 at night. The day after, which is a Friday, the worst travel window shifts to a bit earlier to between 11 and 4. Now the best time to drive most days is before noon or 10 in the morning. So if you're your return home, AAA recommends that drivers hit the road on Monday, July 8th. Meanwhile, another travel record will likely be broken in the air, and more than five and a half million people are projected to fly. That is a 7% increase compared to last year. AAA says that the reason people are traveling are higher consumer confidence, wages, and spending.